You must be my afternoon patient. How are you? Good, 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 good. Well, let me start off by introducing myself. My name is Bailey. I'm an optician, and uh, I've been doing this for two or three years now. I've built up a nice reputation here in town, but regardless of that, um, my service here is to help you get an understanding of what's going on with your eyes, as well as um, to uh, also fit you for some glasses, I think is what you were. Okay, yeah. Well, let me start off. Have you been having any issues with your eyes or anything that's concerning you about your overall condition of your eyes? Okay. All right, so your, your left eye's been having a little bit of dryness, you think? Okay, can you point back to a certain time period that um, you really recognize that to begin being an issue? Okay, yeah, no worries at all. Well, regardless, I'll take a, a really good look at it and we'll, uh, we'll get it figured out for you. And um, besides for that, um, with your prescription, is everything going okay with that? Are you having trouble seeing at all or any trouble focusing far or close distances? <coughs> okay. Yeah, all right. Well, we'll take a look at that as well. Uh, let's just go ahead and start off with some basic tests here. I want to test your people there response between your left and your right eyes, respectively. Um, so would you do me a favor? Um, just focus on the E on my Snellen chart up there, and I'm going to shine this light into your eyes. Don't mind me, okay? Perfect. Just focus on that E. Good. Fantastic. Just keep focusing on that E. Doing a good job. All right. I'm going to put some gloves on. because I want to um, feel around and lift and lower your eyelids just so I can get a better understanding of um, your eyes, the condition of your eyes, dryness and what might be causing those issues, but nothing to be concerned about. Your pupillary response is just normal, just fine. So that all looked good. Um, and you said it was your, which eye? Okay. look here okay so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna pull down your eyelid I'm gonna shine my light into your eye and uh, take a look here okay so just look up for me what you think you you're doing a good job Looks like a little, a little bit of dryness, um, and I noticed some crusty stuff going on on your lower eyelid, um, which could be just a buildup, um, dryness, and then just um, when you wipe your eyes, it, it causes a flush, and it's going to create, um, you know, whether we like it or not, saline. It's going to kind of build up, and uh, if you you know, don't dry it off. It's going to dry up and cause what, you know, that, that crusty stuff. And it's not very, uh, pleasing to have, but, um, nonetheless, I think we can get it figured out. Um, what I do want to do though, is I want to get a sample and, um, run some tests just to see, see and make sure that that's what, what's going on. But regardless, um, I've got some drops that I can give you to uh, fix that, or not fix that, but just aid that until your eyes can um, rest 
and um, get back to normal operation. Um, but regardless, I do want to take a sample, so give me one second, okay? Here's a little Q-tip and a solution that's going to cause that uh, um, dried up um, stuff down there to um, break up and it's going to allow me to get a sample of it and put it in my test tube here to, uh, to submit to the lab. So no big deal. I just want you to know what I'm doing. Okay. Yeah. Go ahead and look up for me. And I'm just getting a little bit of that from the bottom of your eyelid here. Wonderful. Okay. And we'll just put that in our test tube here. And put that over here to send off when, when I get you out of here. But um, I do want to get you some drops, so go ahead and look up for me. We're going to go ahead and get your eyes. Um, Moisturized here. <laughs> so, okay, there's one, and then we're just gonna go ahead and do the other eye. Two. And you're seeing everything okay there? Beautiful, okay. That's exactly what I wanted to hear. Fantastic. All right, now. Let's go ahead and do some basic tests here. Could you, for me, um, read some of this Snellen chart? We're going to go ahead and start on, let's go ahead and start on line three. Perfect. And how about line four? Fantastic. Okay, let's go ahead and move down to line seven. This might be a little bit more difficult, but we're going to see if you can do it. Good job, okay, good work. You think you can get line eight? Okay, let's try reading line eight. Fantastic, and really quick while we're here. What color is that? Green, perfect, and what's that? Red, you betcha, good work, okay. We'll probably go back to that here momentarily just to test strength between the eyes, but um, actually, let's go ahead and do that now. Let's go ahead and knock that out now. I'm going to go ahead and cover your right eye and see if you can't le read line seven for me, okay? Right here. Okay. All right. See if you can read line seven. See if you can read that same line. Read it right to left this time, though, please. So we're going to start over here. Good work. Okay. A little bit more difficult now. We're going to move down to line nine, okay? I'm going to cover your right eye here. See if you can't read that line for me gonna be a little harder. Okay, I am gonna cover your other eye. See if you can read that same line for me, okay? Perfect. Yeah, yeah, right to left. challenging for you there. And it seems like that right eye is um, struggling a little bit more than your left. And I realize that's a difficult line to read, but um, you're better with your left eye. 
obviously than with your right eye. So we're gonna go ahead and do some fractal fractal on lens tests here and to uh, hopefully figure out um, the differences here um, and get you fitted for some correction lenses. <clears throat> but there's not a huge difference, so I'm not too concerned about it. I think uh, it's pretty nominal to be honest, but nonetheless, we want you to be able to see uh, perfectly. So um, let's go ahead and get started on that. How's that, how are those drops feeling in your eye? Feeling okay? All right. Good, 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 all right. We're gonna focus here on line five, okay? I've got a set of lenses, okay? What I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put the lenses over your eyes, and I need you to tell me if it's better with or without, and then we'll um, get an uh, understanding of baseline um, vision through these lenses, and we'll um, from then we'll move on to testing two separate lenses, front and back. So um, we'll start with better with, better without, and then we'll go to lens one or lens two, okay? Perfect. This is all more um, stuff that I need to know on my end, but I just want you to be comfortable here. So I wanted to explain to you the process. Nonetheless, we're gonna go ahead and get started on this, okay? So um, I'm gonna put a lens in front of your eyes. Let me know if this is better or worse, okay? Better or worse? Okay, so better with the lens or without? Without, okay. All right, how about now? Better with the lens or without? With, without, with, without. Okay, so it's clearly better without, okay. So it's probably a very, very minor uh, adjustment that needs to be made on the on the lenses which i figured would be the case there wasn't a massive difference between the two eyes and really you're able to see pretty well anyways but um for uh, all purposes let's go ahead and test these separate lenses while we're at it okay so better with lens one or lens two one two How about now better with lens one or lens two? One or two? Okay, how about now better with lens one or lens two? Lens one or lens two? Okay. now better with lens three or lens four three or four okay let's do this better with lens four or lens five four or five about now? Lens five or lens six? Lens five or lens six? Lens five or lens six? Okay. All right. Very, very minor differences there, but nonetheless, it's probably a one degree difference between the eyes. And, um, it's not necessary per se um, for you to get these lenses made for that minor of a change or difference. Um, typically, I like for patients to have a little bit more of a spread than what we're currently seeing, and your eyes are working wonderfully, besides for the dryness, of course. So uh, it's really up to you if you want to get the exact um, change, but um, if it was me, I'd probably just, you know, work with what I got. <laughs> but whatever you want to do. 
I'll write you the prescription either way, and you can get it filled or you can leave it. Um, so what I want to do now is I want to look into your eyes just to check your eye health overall, check your sclera, um, as well as your optic nerves with my ophthalmoscope. So um, go ahead and do me a favor and look here at my finger, okay? I'm going to go ahead and take a look at your right eye first, okay? Really good. Looks good. All right. Look here at my finger, would you? Good. Follow it over here. And over here. Good. Keep looking at my finger. Good. And over here. Good. Same thing. Okay my finger. My finger. Look at my finger. And over here. Good, good. 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 Look right here. Keep looking right here, please. Look at my nose. Fantastic work, okay. All is well there. Now, very last thing I'd like to do here is test your um, responsiveness of your eyes and consistencies between the two eyes, what I'm going to do is bring my fingers in your peripheral and I just need you to tell me when you see movement on either side, okay? Pretty standard test. Perfect. Okay. All right. So we're going to start. Just let me know when you see movement on either one of my fingers, okay? And good. 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 Okay. And how about now? Good. 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 How about now? Good. 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 Fantastic work. Perfect there. Now I want to ask you, um, since I put that drop, those drops in your eyes earlier, particularly on that eye that was bothering you, um, do you feel like the uh, dryness has subsided a little bit and your eye is more comfortable overall? Any irritation going on there? You feel It feels better? Good, okay. All right. What I want to do, though, is I want to take a look at it with my light, okay? Just to see what's going on there. So do me a favor and look up. Beautiful. And look down. To the left for me, please. Yep, just keep looking left with your eyes only. Beautiful, and look to the right. So, overall, you feel like your general eye health is good, 
and you're feeling better about it now that you have those drops, good, okay. Uh, in regards to your prescription, um, like I said, I'm gonna go ahead and write you this prescription. You can choose whether or not you wanna get this filled completely up to you. Um, if you've got the money for it, go ahead and do it. If not, don't worry about it. You're gonna be okay either way. Um, and in regards to the eye drops, I'm gonna go ahead and write you a prescription for these eye drops. Um, you're gonna put a drop in the morning um, to start your day. And then um, just kind of keep your um, your understanding on, on the dryness or lack thereof of your eye. If it starts to get uncomfortable during the day, feel free to apply more drops. Um, I would never exceed two to the, to the eye that's bothering you. But um, just, you know, kind of play it by ear. It's really no right or wrong way about it. So, but those are gonna help um, to alleviate that dryness as well as um, get your eye back to um, its, its standard health. So that's good. Um, I think that's gonna wrap it up for us. If there's anything else you have um, in mind, uh, please let me know if not. Uh, we'll get you out of here. Okay. Yeah, I can go ahead and fill, fill around in there for you. Any discomfort there? No? How about there? Okay. Anything there? No? There. Well, this could be just kind of where you're sleeping. A lot of times if we sleep kind of on our hands, it can cause uh, very light bruising around the eye. It can be slightly discomforting, but it, it's no issue. Just be mindful of where your sleeping positions are, okay? All right, well, if none of that's bothering you, we'll go ahead and get you out of here, but uh, it's been great to see you again, my friend. And uh, please feel free to stop by anytime. If you have any questions or concerns, you know my number. And uh, we'll look forward to seeing you next time. Okay, my friend? Wonderful. All right. Have a great day. And uh, again, we'll see you next time. All right. Bye now.